Very quickly, I just want to point out that I actually have my AWS credentials locally configured on my uh, desktop computer here already. You can see the documentation in AWS for the AWS command line. Once you have that installed on your computer, the AWS command, you can use the AWS configure command and that'll help you set up your files. It'll go to your home directory, set up a .aws directory within there and create a file called credentials and a file called config and you can set up profiles in there. Now here we show a default profile, which will be used by default if you do not define a profile when you're running AWS commands. Now in my AWS credentials file, I have a profile named Cloudcast instead of default. And we saw in my configuration that that is the profile I chose to use. So I have a key and a secret access key under my profile called Cloudcast. And those uh, keys in the secret relates to an IAM user that has permission to run all the things I need to run within AWS to create servers and do the stuff that Packer needs. So that was just a quick note. This does involve some AWS credentials stuff in order to use Packer in this nature.